There was a morning after feeling at numerous council offices in Stirling, even though this was no holiday in Scotland. Unison says a plan by this Labour-led council to cut £24 million from the budget over three years amounts to a 13% cut. Union members here voted by 9 to 1 to reject it. Members of staff are feeling insignificant and worthless in the process by which this local authority have tried to impose these cuts to them. They want us to work 37 hours a week for less money than what we're getting just now. This is really about how the workforce feel at the moment and this is them out to communicate the strength of their feelings to the local authority and the way that things are being done. Unison and Unite say the council tried to get around pickets by moving some official vehicles out of council depots only to find workers still refuse to drive them. Unison says it's seen a spike in membership applications after council executives wrote to staff threatening them with dismissal if they refused to sign up to the new pay conditions. I've actually requested that those letters be withdrawn in writing. Uh, I've sent a copy on to Unison solicitors because in our view that it's a form of bullying to, to try and intimidate people to sign up. At this stage there's no been any indication of them being prepared to speak to us but uh, we're prepared to talk at any time to try and get a resolution. The unions say the council's cuts plans are by far the worst in Scotland. They say if council staff elsewhere aren't facing these kind of cuts, why should they accept them here? Pete Murray, Union News, Stirling.